What up crew members, welcome to another recipe mukbang video. Today is Super Bowl Sunday. So I'm gonna be showing y'all how to make these game day wings, y'all. This is a tri-flavored wing, buffalo, lemon pepper, uh, garlic, uh, garlic butter wing. Um, really easy to make. So I just started off with a chicken wing that I had washed and had it dry, completely dry, and then I dropped it in my fryer that sat at 300 degrees. Once I had all my wings in there, I did turn the temperature down to 275 because that's the temperature I wanted. And it's a regulating fryer, so I just had it up so that the uh, temperature didn't drop below what I wanted it to start once I added the wings. So after about uh, 15 to 20 minutes of frying those, I take them out and put them on a paper towel, and I'm gonna let them cool for about an hour before I double fry them, which means I'm just gonna fry them again. Yeah, that's right, I'm frying them again, and that's just gonna give me a really extra crispy wing. I let these cool for an hour, come all the way to temperature, and then I'm gonna fry them for five minutes at 375 to 400 degrees. That's just gonna crisp them. I did not season these beforehand because I do not like an over seasoned wing. The buffalo sauce is gonna be enough. Trust me on that. All right, y'all, so in the meantime, I did make my buffalo sauce. I started out with a stick of butter and I added a full bottle of Frank's hot sauce. That's the regular size bottle, not the really small one and not the really big one, but a full bottle of Frank's hot sauce. After that, I'm gonna go in with the Kinder's brand of lemon pepper. This has no salt to it. The hot sauce is salty enough, trust me. And as much as I'm using, if I was to use a salted lemon pepper, it would be too, too salty, overpowering, and it would not be good. And then I'm gonna go in with the same brand of garlic and herb seasoning and remember this is a garlic uh lemon pepper buffalo wing um if you want a more garlicky flavor you can't uh saute some minced garlic before you add the butter and hot sauce to this and it will give you more of a garlic flavor me this seasoning is enough then i'm gonna go in with my secret ingredient to my wings and that's oregano y'all i just add a little bit not too much but it just gives it a really good taste a really good taste y'all i love oregano and all my buffalo wings then i'm gonna add some honey y'all this honey is not gonna make this wing sweet at all but it's gonna balance the flavors it's gonna cut the acidity and the hot sauce and the lemon that's in there and it's also gonna make it more of a consistent sauce kind of like a buffalo sauce i mean a barbecue sauce but um, not making it too sweet at all. You will not taste the sweet. I use about a tablespoon and a half to two tablespoons. Trust me, it's not gonna make it sweet. I just combined that together and then I brought it up to a boil. Once it starts boiling, I take it off the heat and um, give it another stir and let it um, sit. And that was my sauce. This is me the, uh, for my second fry at about 375, y'all. Only for about five minutes. The wings were super crispy right here, y'all. I mean, you can't hear it because of the music, but I am scraping the wings that are really crispy texture. And um, you can see in the inside right here, this is the better way to make your wings crispy other than frying them for an excessive uh, long time just to try to get a crisp because it dries out the inside. You can see here the uh, white meat is still glistening, still good. All right, I put them in a bowl, y'all. Took my sauce, covered them, and you can stop right here and your wings will be delicious and crispy even though they're soft but I like to go a step further and put them in the oven for about five minutes on 375, just so that that uh, flavor can really get in the skin. Add a little bit of additional sauce on top and this is a finished product. Y'all, these are so good. This is Super Bowl Sunday. Like I said, this is a great recipe. Your family will love it. I know we did. Stay tuned for the mukbang. And I already know, like I work myself up. I'm the type of person that has like the anxiety where I will make the symptoms onset <laughs> on my own. <laughs> so, I am dizzy. Yes. Ooh, then I my am. mouth started getting dry. My dumb self on Chrome, the Google, talking about looking for side effects for that uh, antibiotic. You already know. I know they <laughs> are. Runny diarrhea, Ooh. blah, blah, blah. I said, oh, I gotta get off of here. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm AJ. This is Danny with hashtag. 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 Hashtag the candles. CCTV.
Hey everybody, welcome back to our eating show. Show. I right, got today we're back with another mobile and today, baby, tell me what we eat. Y'all, today we have some hot wings over here. It's Super Bowl Sunday and we're doing yeah, a collab yeah, yeah. today. Yeah, so today we're gonna be doing a four-way collab with uh CJ Cerise and SWV. <laughs> really, nigga? Um <laughs> Did you say W? <laughs> I mean, it's BL. <laughs> that is the essence of science, biggest world, and Miss Louisiana housewife. All these lovely women, and um, of course, CJ. At last. <laughs> now I'm playing, bro. <laughs> anyway, y'all. So um, yes, four way collab. This is gonna be the um, Super Bowl party collab, y'all. Super Bowl is tutoring. So um, yeah, we're gonna be. The theme of this is just to pretty much just as if we have a Super Bowl party. I'm bringing the wings now. I, I apparently. I might have got a concept a little bit wrong, but I just got the wings. Other people probably gonna have wings. Some people might have a lot, a big old everything at the Super Bowl party. So make sure y'all go look in the link in the description box. Make sure y'all go check each and every one of those channels out. We are not gonna be long-winded today. We only gonna be up here a short while. We're gonna eat and we're gonna get out the way. So that you guys can first of all go check out the other guy, other channels and second of all enjoy the football game that'll be on later. Today. So that's enough talking y'all. If y'all haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell, set them to all so you'll be notified every single time the can adjust some heat for it is to make sure that you hit that like button. You better do it. You better uh -uh. Do, do it. Hit that motor. Anyway. And uh maybe hashtag throw baby throw hashtag again. We'll be closer to our goal of 100 k Alright y'all, so um Thank you for being here too. We're gonna go ahead and pray. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we ask you to bless this food, Lord. Let it be nursed to our bodies, Lord. Bless those who are less fortunate. All these things we ask in the Son of Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Duh. <laughs> you was over here talking about you better do it. It's not helping with your grandma's cough. No, you didn't. Wait, but you ain't gonna come at me. <laughs> this, this, this fly, man. It's tight. <laughs> Said grandma. You, it got a little paisley on it, but grandma. you know what I'm saying? You're a hater. <laughs> You're a hater. I am not a hater. It just went with the aesthetic. Are you saying you better do it like you about to beat somebody? Yeah, yeah. I'll beat you. I will beat you. So if you ain't like that, I'm coming after you right now. Yeah, I got <laughs> Daniel sitting there scratching a little heat up. This homemade red right, y'all. Scratching my leg. Alright, y'all. Uh, Fresca in the building. Y'all wanna hit a click clack? There you go. Mm. And uh, I got my glass. I got my uh, personalized glass for my wife, y'all. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Turn it down. That probably ain't fit with the ass one, but whatever. <laughs> Wet my whistle. Wet your whistle. Oh. Use them thorns. Shut up. <laughs> Alright, y'all, so. I'm just gonna grab a few off. Right here, y'all. Thank you so much. How many you want, baby? Do five, honey. It's early. I gotta eat some later, yeah. too. <laughs> Thank you. All right, y'all. Y'all wanna see one of these wings up close? I give you a drum. Since we always give you flats. I know. And I got drums today. I, <laughs> give, you, I give you a drum. I give you a little, a little, ooh, look at that, bud. Bust some bit. Oh. No, Here's some ranchy. All right. Uh -uh. So ranch for that ass. Mm -mm. How'd it taste? Delectable. Yeah, this be me. When I'm about to try something I ain't never tried before. And this Danielle. Yeah. This me. Danielle, yeah. hot taste. Shut up! My mouth be right here. Hot <laughs> taste. What it taste already like? be in his mouth. <laughs> Is it good? I'm gonna take God damn. Can I get it in my mouth first, please? Mm. Can I please get a little? Mm-hmm. Is that good? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I remember when I didn't eat wings. I know that was the best time of your life. Oh, baby. <laughs> With some of y'all who've been around for a while. 
Shout out to you, OGs. Mm -hmm. Y'all already know the story. But, uh, um, Danielle at one point did not like hot wings like that every time. Because we can come, if I'm off work, it's like, baby, your boy need to get some hot <laughs> wings. I want a hot wing. So, yeah, usually conversation come around. What are we going to eat today? Oh, I want to get some hot wings. They'll be like, Mm -mm. I don't want that shit. <laughs> and I've always been the type to be like, get what you want. Like, <laughs> but she want to have the same thing anyway. <laughs> that was the best of times because she wouldn't really eat them. Like, she was like, if we, if that's all we got, well, of course she would, but she'd eat what she wanted and leave it alone. Most of the time we got like pizza with it. If mm -hmm. I was getting hot wings, we get pizza because she liked the pizza. She ain't mess with that way like that. Bada boom, bada bam, there you go. But, eventually, she started catching on <laughs> how good them bitches were. And at one point, I could get, I didn't even have to buy that many because I have most of them myself. And um, then she started catching on. They were the end of that. Party over. I didn't know they were so good. And then she, <laughs> she started eating them like I did. I was mm -hmm. like, man, I remember I was like, I could buy <laughs> I could buy uh, 20 wings. I could buy 15 wings. It don't matter. But she ain't gonna touch them. Then now, now I be touching and pulling and chewing. <laughs> we trying to be territorial of them. <laughs> With just five wings left, she trying to get two or three of them. I'm like, I don't be trying to do three. Now don't you do me. You do. I do two. If there's 10 wings left, if I eat more than half the next day, she mad. Yeah, this is actually half. <laughs> <laughs> Which, I don't care. My point is, it was the best of days when she didn't eat wings and I ate them. <laughs> <laughs> when, I, when, when I ate them and she did, mm -hmm. good times. Anytime you need a payment. Mm -mm. <laughs> Oh, these so good. Mm -hmm. And I double fried them. See, I'm mm, not telling. But they're not super crispy right now because I put them back in the oven. But <clears throat> they are crispy. And if you're somebody like me who like your wings saucy, but you don't want it flabby skin. This is the best route because instead of frying them just straight for a longer period of time to get them crispy, if you double fry them, you fry them on a lower heat first for 20 minutes that cook through, but then let them cool and you fry them again. It is outside is crisp up real good, but the inside It'll still be like juicy. You know, hey, so if you like crispy wings, then you know sometimes you get them fried hard and they be dry. You kind of pull at the skin mm -hmm. and you have to pull like, sometimes that can be like, you like, damn, I want them sometimes crispy. Sometimes wing stop does that. Yeah, because they fry them longer. <laughs> they fry them longer to get them crispy. Mm -hmm. And so this way is better. That way you get the skin, you get the skin kind of dried out, crispy, but the inside still it's soft and you know you still got a good bite to it mm -hmm. and if i didn't put them back in the oven you'd be hearing these you'd be hearing them with the sauce on them you'd be hearing because <laughs> uh the oven just you know i put it back in the oven because i just like for that sauce to really soak in and flavor them up it'd be good y'all didn't realize hell's kitchen that came back on and I was trying to watch it on Fox now. And they just going to cut me off at 12 o'clock. Super Bowl, pre-whatever. I said, oh my God. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching that. I mean, they limited everything. I think the only thing I could click on was to watch live. I couldn't even scroll to see shows. There ain't even shit going on right now. No. Eat this dirty celery. <laughs> <Ugh>. <laughs> Uh, I'm tired of wasting my damn soul. I don't give a fuck, Keisha. I'm gonna stab you in your throat with it. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you ate it. 
Mm-mm. They want it so bad. It's actually good. Yeah. Pretty <laughs> Also, as we was watching Hell's Kitchen, somebody did what, AJ, to some collards? Put some goddamn orange oh, soda. Oh, Lord. I said mix and then, them. And then he's going to tell them orange soda collards. Um, Gordon Ramsay, you're going to give Gordon Ramsay some hmm. orange soda right. collards, right? And then you supposed to be like displaying yourself and this is what you decide to do. Damn shame. Yeah. Not only that. Does he have like, what do you have on the bottom? Like a polenta and some grits or something? Yeah, like grits, I think. He's gonna put, <laughs> he's gonna drizzle a little orange soda on the plate and it's all around the grits. I said, fool. My <laughs> thing is that orange soda has a very strong flavor, like. It is like blow your face off. His salmon was actually cooked really well. But he didn't even get. <laughs> he didn't really get the fork because that was rating. He was rating one through five. Mm -hmm. He told him that his dish would have been five worthy, but that one shot messed it up. Gave him three. You idiot. No, I don't know why he proudly said, yes, this is orange soda collard greens. And everybody laughing. Looking dumb. Because it was hilarious to me. Like if you got the gall to say and do something like that, that baby boy, you better knock somebody's socks off. Exactly. And he made me think that it was going to be good. Was not apparently. <laughs> And then this man from uh, Tennessee talking about, I have never seen anybody put orange soda in collard greens, and when I go home, I don't plan on trying it. <laughs> can you give me about two, two more? Yeah, yes. Thank you. And I you won't can try. Have whatever you like. I won't try to get full. Be tricking. <laughs> Thank y'all. But yeah, over here putting orange juice, orange soda in collards. I wonder what that tastes like. I know. It reminded me when you and mommy yesterday talking now, about sweet green beans. <laughs> it do remind me of something that like somebody would do, like a soul food restaurant. Mm. You know, in somebody's hometown. Mm -hmm. They got a special and everybody rave over it. Mm -hmm. But even if that was the case, I would not give Gordon Ramsay <laughs> no no. That's not him. Orange soda, bro. Mm -hmm. It would have been, what about orange juice? Even then, just shut up. <laughs> if you put it in there, just shh. I think he shouldn't have told him unless he asked him. But the worst part is, even if the greens was flavorful, he had orange soda around the edge, just plain orange soda around the right. edge of the plate. What is that? So nasty. As soon as Gordon picked the plate up, he was like, this is a little runny. He talking about, yeah, it's orange soda. <laughs> Like, like he proud. Yes. <laughs> Who are you, Kel? Mom gonna complain about these wings. Yes, she is. <laughs> the funny thing, why? I don't know. It's just regular very hot. I didn't, mm. but I, it's not hot. But you know, I feel the. Re she, I don't think she likes to feel any type of residual heat on her tongue. Mm-hmm. And I feel residual heat on my tongue. I didn't realize it until I had like took a break from eating them and I'm like, um, these are a little spicy. It's good to me though. I eat way more heat than I used to. Remember it's how I used to come I'm be concentrated. Mm -hmm. I figured the honey I put in there would cut it. Mm -hmm. But I mean it's not, it's just regular red hot, but she's gonna say something. Shut up. <laughs> she went. <laughs> but um uh, I was gonna ask you, do you ever like, cause y'all, I have, um, something happened to my finger. And so, it was puffed up and AJ made me go to, <laughs> I think I said it on live, AJ made me go to the urgent care. And so, I went in there, I am not gonna talk about that experience cause it wasn't good. Fucked up. But, um, they gave me an antibiotic or whatever, so I've been taking it for the last two days. And when I was in there doing my makeup, I'm like, am I dizzy? <laughs> <clears throat> and I already know like I'll work myself up. I'm the type of person that has like the anxiety where 
I will make the symptoms onset <laughs> on my own. <laughs> so, I am dizzy. Yes. Ooh, then I my am. mouth started getting dry. My dumb self on Chrome, the Google, talking about looking for side effects for that, uh, well, you, that antibiotic. You already done fucked up. I know they are. Oh, <laughs> runny diarrhea, Ooh. blah, blah, blah. I said, oh, I gotta get off of here. But do you ever like scare yourself like that? I be like, I wish I yes. had never. And in my in my uh, uh, uh. in my age and wisdom, after sitting here going through shit, I just tell myself to breathe and think. That's rash what I did. Think rationally. <laughs> Do not send yourself into a, a drove panic. Yeah. Because I, your body responds to stress no matter what. So. Yeah. <laughs> I have remembered that I drank the energy drink this morning. And one thing that I've noticed over the years is that. If I throw an energy drink back like I did this morning, it makes me like anxious and make me feel like my throat is closing. And I said, oh, Daniel, you drank that energy drink this morning. <laughs> Crazy. Ain't nobody tell you to throw it back either. I know. <laughs> Excuse me. I think it's because I was trying to burp. <laughs> it has some carbonation. I'm sure. Uh, I know sometimes... Like, I'm not really caffeine sensitive, but sometimes, like, if I have, like, consumed, like, extra bit of caffeine in a day that I normally will, mm -hmm. like, sometimes it'll, like, kick in the overdrive, and it's like, I'll be like... Mm -mm. <laughs> Thinking at three. Yeah, I'll be like, no, I'll just be feeling like... Oh. Like, I'll be, like, <laughs> getting worked up, like... And I'll be just standing there. I'll be like, what's going on? Right. I'm like, I have to remember. I'm like, nigga, you yep. too much today. It's crazy because how you'll forget. But my first thought went antibiotic. It's you. <laughs> you. You're doing this. <laughs> you with a red anaphylactic shot. Your ass would have been up. That would have been the end. <laughs> I'm about to go down in this bathroom. <laughs> I always think the worst. That's crazy. It was. I know I'm the type of person I will make the symptoms on sweat, okay? I mean, on set. On sweat. Because I was about to say, I saw sweaty palms. I said, ooh, is my hand sweating? <laughs> <laughs> Touching everything. And that's why, because y'all, we got to straighten up because we had folk come over. That's why I started cleaning the bathroom. Because I said, I got to do something to get my mind. I, yeah, I am. I said, I gotta do something. I said, this man don't even know I'm in here panicking right now. <laughs> you are insane. I had to do something. I had to change. Do you something. don't get a seven brew. Uh, <laughs> don't give me nothing. Don't you give me you nothing. You don't get a drink today. Don't get, you, you is right. Don't give me shit. <laughs> I'm going to get one for later. We'll get a Xanax. What about that? Okay. <laughs> Even me out. Take me down, honey. That's a mess. So, y'all, um, stick to my word. I promise y'all wasn't going to hold you today. So, we about to wrap this video up. Really, uh, y'all, big shout out to uh, 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 SVL, which is uh, the Essence of Science, That's Vicky's good. World, and Miss Louisiana Housewife and Madison. So, shout out to Maddie. Mm -hmm. um, also, shout out to CJ and Cerise yes. for this collab, y'all. Please, please, please. Please, 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 please. I can't stress enough. Y'all go. If you love the cannons, please go and... Um, Visit those channels. Tell them the hashtag the Candace sent you. Show them some love. Watch their videos. Check out some of their other content mm -hmm. and subscribe, y'all. That is the purpose for this collab because we do support other content creators. Uh -uh. So yeah, y'all. Um, I hope y'all have a good game day today, y'all. Um, we also gonna be doing a little bit more cooking. Um, the reason you saw me with the tongs and me trying to stay over here and not breathe all off on the food is because, um, of course, these are gonna be served uh, later on to my uh, family. Mm -hmm. Not as a leftover thing, but you know, they gonna go with the, all the other stuff that we're doing. So I hope y'all have a good game day if you're watching the game, you know what I'm saying? Y'all have fun, party, don't get too drunk. If you're drinking, you be safe. If you're me. out, if you're out at a bar somewhere, be safe, don't, you know, get in any type of altercations, or whatever, right. and um, just get home safe. And um, yeah, y'all, so we love you. If you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Y'all hit that uh, like button, drop a comment down below, let us know what you think of the video. Remember, guys, to share the video because sharing is caring, so care about us, care about us. We love you and we mean that. Thing. Shout out to the crew. Shout out to you. Y'all have a good week. Bye bye.